had the privilege of doing something that I had never done before. And I'm really going to try to hold it together here because I got to see what was called first look with my daughter. As I walked in and looked at her, and you all see a beautiful and I feel very talented young lady. But to be honest with you, all I saw was my little girl. It was actually in Denver that we first um, had the pleasure of meeting Amy for the first time. And we could tell immediately her warmth and instant connection with us that PJ had found someone equally as special as him. So it's no surprise that we find ourselves here today, halfway across the world, uh, to bear witness to their commitment to each other. Uh, you two are only just now beginning the journeys of your, the rest of your lives, and we're all excited to see where the journey takes you. PJ, we are so incredibly excited to have you part of the family. The way Amy looks at you radiates her love for you. There is no doubt how much you two care for each other, and we know your marriage will be one filled with incredible happiness and love. Amy, wear this ring as a sign of our faithful love. In the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. PJ, wear this ring as a sign of our faithful love. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. You are the most intelligent, beautiful, caring, thoughtful, a uh, woman I've ever met. You make me a better man. I love you. Thank you, everybody. And cheers. Thanks for coming. So now I think it's traditional for the bride and groom to exchange a symbol of your love. <laughs> PJ, and um, I know she is now your wife, but this lecture has been given to two other sons that have entered the family. I expect you to cherish her, take care of her, be there for her. My wish and hope is that you two can just have one small bit, one, one small fraction of the love and understanding that my family has given me. For if you have that, your life and your marriage will truly, truly be blessed. I love you both, and thank you. I'd say a big thanks to Pat and Jeannie and Len. Obviously, we wouldn't be here if it wasn't for the four of you at some stage or another. Uh, <laughs> Amy, you look beautiful tonight, and I think everyone would agree. So, cheers. Slancha.